How about this? There's new research. It says taking aspirin could lower your risk of cancer. That's a new one for me. But Doc Siegel is here with the full story. What's this all about? This is very exciting. <laughs> You're attacking me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. It is. 132,000 people were studied over 32 years. They didn't prove this, but they showed an association of up to 19% decrease in cancers if you took an aspirin a week. An aspirin a week? Right, an aspirin a week. Now, most of us take an aspirin a day, 81 milligrams a day. So the point is that's even more than enough. Most of us do. Well, I do. <laughs> you are so superior. But, 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 but look, I would take an aspirin. To, uh, doesn't it thin your blood or something when you're going along? Yes, but it's an also an anti-inflammatory. It comes from tree bark. It's an anti-inflammatory. So in your colon, we've known this for a long time, but this is the closest we've ever come to proof. In your colon, it decreases your risk of that inflammation you get in the colon huh. that leads to cancer. Let me tell you how this works in the doctor's yeah. office. I'm sitting there, and I say... Should I give you an aspirin a day or shouldn't I? Well, you have a family history of heart disease, you have a high cholesterol. Yeah. I'm thinking maybe I should. And then I think you have a family history of colon cancer. Now, I'm, the needle has moved, Stuart. Now, because of this study, I'm more likely to give it to you, thinking I'm going to decrease your risk of colon cancer, too. And it does. And it does. Statistically, there's I believe it does. I believe okay. it does. Doesn't I believe it also, this is a very exciting study. Doesn't it also lead to your stomach bleeding, the lining of your stomach bleeding? Well, so then that's the downside of that. It increases your risk of bleeds. It increases the risk I might end up having to send you to the hospital for a bleed. This is a serious downside. I have to weigh the pro pluses and minuses. Who's more prone to bleeding and who isn't? But you've, there is an association between taking an aspirin a week and a slightly less risk of cancer. And this Polar has cancer. moved the needle in the right. direction of using it. Oh, it's good stuff, yeah, Siegel. Yeah. You know, I don't Over the age of 50. Yeah, oh, now, you're right. not there yet. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. right. Thank you very much, Doctor. Appreciate it. All right.